Hello floodies and globe defenders, it's Critical Thing from Down Under. And uh, Ranty thinks that he's just proven that the inferior mirage causes a blockage rather than curvature causing the blockage. Well, let's take a close look at his own evidence and uh, let's prove him wrong. <laughs> In summary, there have been various claims by flat thinkers that we do not observe obstruction due to curvature. They give a number of excuses, one of which involves the inferior mirage. In this video, I examine Ranty's recent claim to have, quote, proven, unquote, that the inferior mirage is a layer of, quote, dirty air, unquote. I'll examine this more closely with a critical eye. I have dealt with this subject quite comprehensively in a previous video. I clearly demonstrated that the mirage occurs as a reflection off a surface or a refraction effect in a thin layer of air close to the surface. The reflected image does not hang in the air like a hologram. There is no science whatsoever to support this and much evidence to dispute this. My previous videos on the subject will be linked in the description. Here's an example of an inferior mirage which cannot hang in the air, otherwise that truck would be hanging in the air. And now I'm going to play two videos. One of which is, the first one is Ranty's, the second one is mine. Both of which show the wake of a ship and a boat which seems to hang in the air. Now obviously it cannot hang in the air. This wake must be on the surface of the water and the surface of the water is at the line where the inferior mirage meets the boat or ship. So the inferior mirage is actually on the surface of the water and not hanging in the air. Let's watch it. So here I am, back at Anchor's home, it's low tide yet again, different weather, different conditions and essentially we're going to be looking at the buildings of Barrow again, this time without the inferior mirage. Um, so the video I released a couple of days ago that showed the atmospheric blocking which was caused by the inferior mirage that blocked out the sand dunes and, uh, and alike, that isn't in play today. So what you're going to see is completely different and obviously we're not talking about earth curve here we're talking about the effects of the inferior mirage it's the same height of tide so clearly the blockage was atmospheric the inferior mirage was in the air in the atmosphere it was not on the water it was not curvature of the earth it was the atmosphere causing the blockage this is what we should have seen the last time we were here filming with the inferior mirage however we didn't see that we saw the the buildings as they are now but then we didn't see the sand dune in front of them there was a, a mirror image inverted of the buildings that was causing a blockage now you can see today that a direct line of sight isn't curvature, a direct line of sight is atmospheric. So the inferior mirage was happening in the air. So yet again, 100% proof that the inferior mirage happens in the atmosphere. And that inferior mirage blocks out the bottom of things.
the inferior mirage happens in the atmosphere. The inferior mirage happens in the atmosphere. The inferior mirage happens in the atmosphere.